What's going on everybody? How are you doing today? So here I am in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. This video takes place in Los Angeles. You know, in Halloween, when Michael's following Tommy home from school, I always thought he was drifting his hands along the fence. Michael was. Is there a scene that, like, is it cut out of, like, the DVD or something? I don't know. It freaked me out as a kid that he was, like, dangling his fingers along. But I think that was just my imagination. So anyways, so I matched that up, which doesn't match up. That's just a park. As you can hear, there's people out there playing in a public park while I'm trying to film. Get out. Anyway, this video is from like 2017. It's one of the earliest videos I've ever done for YouTube. I never put it up. I've got lots of videos that I've never put up on YouTube. Most I plan on redoing. Some I'm going to upload as I go along. Some are just from like last year. But some of this is like almost three years old. And it's from an obscure Halloween location. And I like the video because it kind of shows how difficult it is to find filming locations. Especially obscure ones. And... The process that I went through, like I'm moving the camera around, I'm going like, you know, and just, yeah, now I've learned to keep it a little more steady. Steady, somewhat. Um, but yeah, so it's it's kind of like interesting to watch, I guess, in terms of, you're not in this one, buddy. It's kind of, it's all about this guy. There he, there he is, there he is. Yeah, it's all about Michael Myers. So this is about three years old, roughly. And I'm wearing the sunglasses and everything, but it, I, the light with my eyes, contact lenses, it's a whole thing. Anyway, I hope you liked the video. Let's go. You're still my favorite though, Jason, you are. All right, cue the laughter. My intro, I love it. Let's go. I know you're gonna dig this. Get, get, get funky with me. Answer me. Fine. So, you ever spend a lot of time looking for a really obscure movie location? Like hunting it down for hours and hours online? No, you haven't? I have. Shocker. But I found it. This is it. After much searching, Googling, freeze framing, this is where the entrance to Smith's Grove in Sanatorium. In Sanatorium? Sanatorium. What am I saying in Sanatorium? Oh, somebody watched my channel. Their channel name is in Sanatorium. Smith's Grove Sanatorium. Terium? It's called a mental hospital back then. It's not politically correct now to say it, but that's what it was. And this is where they housed Michael Myers. Right up this road. Right up here. This is the Hollywood Reservoir down in there. Hope I don't see any dogs in the reservoir. <laughs> Get it? Okay. But look, this is where they shot it. They shot the, uh, when Michael escapes from the hospital, it was all shot right here. They made this look like it went into a hospital for the, for the mental, the hospital for Michael, you know what I'm saying. This is where the hospital for psychopathic killers. Leave it at that. They don't deserve some. Well, they do. this is where the hospital for psychopathic killers. It's up here. And you can see this all in the background. This cement part still remains. So all these Hollywood streets here. Let me turn this around. It's hard. So all these Hollywood streets around here, they were used for the drive up. They are twisty. They are turny. They are creepy at night. Let me tell you. Not creepy, but they're just windy. Well, they're just a little, they, you know, for a less experienced driver, they could be a little uh, scary. But keep your lights on, be safe, you'll be fine. But this is Lake Hollywood Boulevard. This is the entranceway. Michael Myers jumped in the car right around here. Now it's all changed. It's been 40 years, people. So there's new houses, it looks different, but this is the entranceway that they used. And like I said, Lake Hollywood. But here it is. It's funny, I was just at another location for something else, shooting something, and I drove by here and I said, oh yeah, oh yeah, I forgot about that place. And now I've come here and I've filmed this place.
The amount of people that I see jogging through the Hollywood Hills all the time is staggering. Going for a walk, maybe. Jogging, no. What are you doing? They're so steep. It just seems tiring. As soon as I would get on the street, I'd be like, ah, ah. Stay on your treadmill at home. I, but it just seems like less work. But you want the fresh air, you want the whole thing, and it's Hollywood, of course. So, Hollywood is down that way, by the way. This is the Hollywood Hills, though. Okay, so Michael Myers escaped from the sanitarium right here. Jumped in the car here. Stole the car. And then he went back to Haddonfield, which is a long way from here. He went back to Haddonfield. And he got shit done. So I hope you enjoyed this little look, uh, look at Halloween. One location. There's others on my channel. But this one's really cool. I wanted to find it. And I did. Now I gotta go find something else before the sun goes down. May have lost that. It's getting dark. And I'm outside a psycho hospital right here behind me. So I should get going. Get off my car, dude. No, I'm not driving you to Illinois. I'm not doing it. I can't. Okay, I will. Nice guy. I know you won't kill me. <laughs> I'm so trusting. You think you're annoyed by me? Try living in here. Ow. All right. Peace. Out. Smith's Grove. When did he get the mask in Halloween? Now I can't remember. Wait a minute. Did he have the mask? No, he escaped. He steals the mask from the hardware store? I can't remember. No, he didn't steal from the hardware store. Some kid wearing it? I've seen the movie 87 times. Now I'm forgetting. Well, he doesn't have the mask in this scene. So you see Michael Myers. You don't see his face. You see his face when she pulls it up in the house near the end of the movie. But all you see is a lumbering figure over top of a car like that. Well, the car didn't look like that because it was 40 years ago. This car didn't exist. This car was somebody's dream. Whose dream? I don't know. Now I'm thinking it could have been this entrance. This entrance kind of looks like there would be more room to film. There's three entrances, not including the one on the opposite side, which I know is not it. But the... Because this cement wall is here too. There's only three entrances. I'm showing you two of them. Well, this is the stupidest thing ever. Now I'm angry. I think it was this one. Let me see. Well, more like it, kind of? Kind of? Like, look at the surrounding area. Be able to film more. But there's the giant poles. There's poles in the back of the scene, right? And they go up around a bend like that. But the other place had a bend. Oh, man. Look at that entrance, but that's like the same entrance. But the cement thing is seen in the film. Well, we're on a real hunt now, people. But I, I can't. I'm about to lose daylight. I've lost it. Look, the moon is out. The moon is out. I, I don't know. Oh, a light came on when I walked by. Sorry. Well, I think it might be this one. Because you do see that in the background. All the way up there. Where are those poles that you see in the background? Well, I don't know. Look, I came close. It's one of the two. I've seen them both. 
let's decide online. I'll show you the pictures of each, or video of each, you know what I'm saying? So with the screenshots, we'll figure it out, which one. This is a little more south. I was under the impression it was the north entrance. But this could be it. All right, Halloween fans, get on it, if you're a Halloween fan. Tell me which entrance it is. I'm sure it's the other one. But now I'm thinking it's this one. So I'm not sure of anything anymore. Ugh. Okay. Can you see it behind me? Can you see it? Let me show you. All right, now I gotta say, which one is it, guys? If you're a big Halloween fan, let me know if you know. I know, it's the other one. Could be this one. I like to get these things right on. Right on. All right, peace out. From Smith's Groves, Ontario, once again, that whole thing.